the Appalachian night, unraveling the enigma of Point Pleasant's Mothman in the sleepy town of Point Pleasant, West Virginia, where the Ohio River whispers secrets to the wind. An air of mystery clings to the shadows like a damp mist. It On certain nights, when the sun dips into the horizon like a burning ember, the townsfolk sense the presence of something otherworldly. The rustling of leaves, the snapping of twigs, and the soft hooting of owls all seem to coalesce into a single unifying melody, the hum of the mothman's wings. It's an eerie sound that sends shivers down the spines of even the most seasoned residents. The summer of 1966 marked the beginning of a chain reaction in Point Pleasant, as a series of bizarre occurrences set off a sense of unease among the townsfolk. It started with fleeting glimpses of a creature tall and winged, its eyes glowing like hot coals in the dark. Those who claimed to have seen it described the Mothman as an omen. A harbinger of doom that seemed to appear whenever the town was on the verge of disaster. As the sightings grew more frequent, so did the sense of dread that settled over Point Pleasant. The townsfolk began to whisper among themselves about an impending catastrophe, one that would shake the very foundations of their community. It was as if the Mothman had taken up residence in the town's collective psyche, its presence a constant reminder of the unknown forces that lurked just beyond the edge of reality. The most compelling piece of evidence came from John Burchett, a witness who claimed to have seen the creature perched atop the Silver Bridge on the fateful night of its collapse. His account is both vivid and disturbing, painting a picture of an otherworldly being that seemed to be watching the bridge with an air of malevolent glee. The Mothman's eyes were like nothing I've ever seen before, Burchett recalled in an interview. They glowed red-hot, like embers from a fire that never went out. It was as if it was taunting me, daring me to come closer. The Collapse of the Silver Bridge on December 15, 1967 sent shockwaves through Point Pleasant, claiming the lives of 46 people. While some pointed fingers at human error or natural disaster, others whispered a different tale, one of supernatural warning and foreboding. In the aftermath of that fateful night, the Mothman became an integral part of Point Pleasant's identity a ghostly presence woven into the very fabric of everyday life. Visitors from far and wide came to experience the town's eerie atmosphere, each one leaving with stories of unexplained occurrences and sightings. As the years have passed, the legend of the Mothman has only grown stronger, its mystique woven into the town's folklore like a rich tapestry. Poinsent remains forever changed by the event of 1967, its people forever bound to the enigmatic creature that embodies both awe-inspiring mystery and unrelenting terror. The Mothman's presence still lingers in Point Pleasant, a reminder that some secrets are best left unspoken, and that the unknown can be as beautiful as it is terrifying. On quiet nights, when the wind carries the whispers of its wings, the townsfolk will often pause their ears straining to catch the soft rustle of its feathers, a haunting reminder that